You may remember not too long ago, Tim Sweeney, who of course is the Epic Games co-founder, made some pretty scathing remarks regarding Windows 10 and Microsoft's UWP program. Now, if you missed my original video on this particular topic, I will link it in the description below, but basically he wasn't best pleased and basically indicated an attempt to establish a monopoly via the Universal Windows platform. Now, he did later concede that he didn't really have any solid proof of this big evil conspiracy and of course Microsoft maintained that UWP would be more open and promised information during build and a few other things but there is a new update since then. It seems Tim is not satisfied. According to him, at build Microsoft did show some cool new open features of the Universal Windows platform and talked about the plan of being open without actually commenting on it and basically said that it doesn't trust them to keep UWP open without a clear commitment. And I'm going to read out a series of tweets here. Yeah. And he said, quote, Yes, what we really want is a clear Microsoft commitment to UWP being open in a, in a specific technical way. At Bill, Microsoft showed cool new open features of UWP and stated their plan, but not a commitment. And then someone responded, I know your issue with the mess. You have a lack of trust with them personally and the new Windows vision. And to which Tim replied, I trust Phil Spencer. I don't trust Microsoft Corp to keep UWP open when they haven't committed to that. And then he was, not, he was actually asked, well, what is it that you're looking here for here from Microsoft to feel assured that they're actually going to stick to their promise, I guess you could say, or plan of UWP remaining open? And Tim replied, quote, that was a forward-looking statement about a plan, seeking a clear loss in commitment on specific technical points. And then he went on to say, quote, I'm follow up in, following up in detail with Microsoft folks. If they won't stare at a clear and specific commitment, then yes. And that was in response to a question of, will we be getting a follow-up statement detailing how the points addressed or not addressed by the build presentation? So basically, Tim isn't convinced and probably won't be convinced until we hear Microsoft or Phil Spencer or whoever from Microsoft say the words, we 100% commit to making UWP open. What Tim is basically saying here is they're being very wishy-washy at the moment with the talks of plans and that sort of thing they're not actually 100% saying this will definitely happen so they're giving themselves a back out room and Tim is basically suspicious that back out is exactly what they're going to do and when it comes to big companies you should always remain skeptical no matter who they are even if you're a fan of their products games whatever you should always remain skeptical when it comes to the big corporation itself so I don't blame Tim for being sceptical, but uh, we're going to have to wait and see. Of course, he made those scathing remarks without a huge... I mean, he did have some foundations for those to believe, but there wasn't a real proof of the evil plan he was talking about then. So we should also keep that in mind. But I'm very curious to see Tim's comments after he spoke with Microsoft and his full deconstruction of this discuss stuff discussed at Build. Hopefully we can get a positive resolution that, hey these worries over nothing and UWP is going to be open because right now there are some very real concerns. So let's see what happens. I think everyone in the PC gaming space is going to be watching closely because this is going to be key to the uptake of both Windows 10 and the Windows Store itself. So there you go. Let me know your thoughts on this one, guys. What do you think Microsoft are going to say? Do you think they're actually going to 100% commit? Or do you think they're going to remain in the wishy-washy seas of PR language? Do let me know. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.